What's up guys, those of you who are familiar with the channel are familiar with Brent Bowers, and he bought his second bowling alley. This is Seneca Bowl, and this is part two to me bowling him to try and take his keys. And we got some special rules we'll talk about later. Good luck. Thank you. It's two game total pins. Every time that you're up by 20 pins or more, you gotta move 10. So if you're up 20, you gotta move 10. Either direction, doesn't matter. 10 with your target. You are sick. Making me do that on television? Oh, you put me in first, huh? You didn't you put You put the names I in, know. what? All right, so total pinfall. I don't even know how to one work these things. One game on two, you own the place. one game on one. Yeah, I'm gonna get keys either way. It's either gonna be the lawnmower or the building. I'm just saying. I thought you were gonna come and uh, mow the help our youth program do some stuff. I was. I could do that instead, but you told me you wanted me to mow instead. I want all of it. I, I, don't, I want everything. Oh, yeah. we did say clean the gutters. Clean the gutters. And help out the youth program. Baby. This is called Seneca Bowl, 1909 South Seneca. See y'all. See you next time. Built in 1960. Bowling was so popular back in those days, they financed it a lot like the casinos finance themselves now. 16 lanes in one year. In 1961, they added 20 more. That's how popular bowling was. This center reminds me a lot of the center I grew up in. Uh, this one feels like if Thunderbird Bowl and my home center of Countryside Lanes got married and had a baby. This is, this is it? Yeah, because Countryside had the blue gutters. It was a Brunswick center like this, had the AS90s. My home center has... It had those ball racks. That, that, those same countertops were the same, but it has the T-Bird scoring. It's got the T-Bird elevation in the back. Uh, the elevation in the back is always nice. Like, if the same thing happened at North Rock, how, like, if you come in to watch, if there's a tournament, you're already above the bowlers. Yeah. It's nice. That hit, that hit hits here. With hits like that, it's like you own the place, all right? It's like you got a guy hey, in the back. Mechanics up there. There is no mechanic in the back at the moment. Thanks to today's video sponsor, the Golden Nugget Online Casino. Looking for the Vegas experience, but don't want to leave the comfort of your house? You can log on to the Golden Nugget Online Casino. I use the Golden Nugget Online Casino to play some of my favorite games while I'm sitting around during a lot of the downtime that I have traveling the country when we're bowling on tour. All new customers who sign up using promo code HOUSEBOWLING and make a minimum $5 deposit will get $50 immediately in casino credits. You heard right, the Gold Nugget Online Casino is giving away $50 in casino credits to all new customers who sign up using promo code HOUSEBOWLING and make a minimum deposit of $5. With a variety of slot games to choose from like Cleopatra, to fortune coin, as well as an assortment of Golden Nugget exclusives, there are so many ways to have fun. Sign up using promo code HOUSEBOWLING and bring that Vegas experience right to your front door. Oh no. He didn't like that one, but Seneca, very forgiving. Very, very forgiving. forgiving. You said the scores have been up lately. The scores have been on the rise. There's a lot to it, and we're learning. We don't know what, you know. You know me, I'm fully transparent, right? So like, we're gonna publish the lane pattern at both places on our website. Anybody that wants to know, our goal is to help our customers score their best. Because when they score high, they eat more, they drink more, they smile more, they come back. I don't like to change it a whole bunch because you change a whole bunch, and I think that's confusing. We'll make it as easy as we can, and then let the customers figure it out. That is a good strategy. Oh boy. Yep. You just you just said that head hits here. Evidently lane two. And lane, I saw you do it on lane one like four times when we were warming up. I haven't ever used that ball here. This is the first time with that ball. 15 pounder. 15? Yeah. Maybe I you need to switch. It's one of the balls that I was gonna try 15 and I haven't used it much. Hook. Oh my Lanta. He's you begging for it. You said they're easy. You said they're easy. It's not Just my Just like fault. Brian Voss, our good friend Brian Voss. Yeah. Yes! I always love the old PBA tape. I that, call it the Chris Barnes highlight tape. There was a, there's a lot of stuff here from the original time, and I'm a big fan of that stuff. And there's a whole stack of VHS tapes I found, and one of them is an old PBA promotional video, and it's all the PBA players like Randy Peterson, and it's like an action reel of them bowling to like the song Great Balls of Fire by Jerry Lee Lewis. I love that. And, and growing up on Saturday mornings at Countryside, my mom would start every Saturday morning youth league playing that video and the Great Balls of Fire song, right, as like the first five minutes of practice. 
and then the last five minutes of practice, she would play We Are the Champions by Queen. I love it. Every that. single totally. Saturday morning. I got goosebumps. And you don't recognize it, but it, it's somewhat inspirational. Little kids look at that and think, I want to do that one day. I want to be that. Yeah. I want to be that one day. We might be in good shape today. You see my brand new shoes? Brand. They're, ne they're nearly brand new. These they things do are look pretty, pretty clean. new, to be honest. We do have brand new house shoes on the way and house balls. House balls are supposed to drop today. Uh, it's supposed to be three pallets of house balls. I don't know what that means. I know if three anybody pallets. wants any of our house balls, please feel free to come get them now. My Lord. I'm basically throwing it. All right, get everywhere. out of here. An arrow to the left, an arrow to the right. All I know is when I have to start moving, because I will be starting to move at some point here shortly, I'm cooking up a miss from you. Oh, that would have been great. I thought oh it was going to happen. my God. I right, you got to move now. I thought you were going to 5'7". A little juicy there in the middle. So I gotta move now. Do you? Hey, you know the rules, you're an honest man. Gotta move my target by 10? That's a lot. Uh-oh. Moving your target by 10's a lot. That'll even hey. it up pretty quick. And look what I remembered today. The real set of keys? I thought you were gonna bring in some plastic set that old Lizzie used to play with. Well, she's still playing with them. <laughs> Brought the spare ball today. Learn from my mistakes. Now I'm moving right back. No, oh, no, no. Whoa. Like, I think you're going to have to move again. Because I think you, it happened right I think after you moved it's, prematurely. It's just based off the maximum score potential. Would Holly. it be better for the show if we bounced it or slid it? <laughs> it's only 15. If you can guarantee a bounce, bounce it, but... I mean, I don't know if I can. Oh, that's a bold strategy if you're going to shoot the 10 and pop that thing I out. don't think I can slice that. I'm not sharp enough to slice that. Yeah, if you throw a little baby cutter at the gutter. I don't think so. I don't know enough about how they bounce here. I think so let's, let's learn. Let's, let's get some data. <laughs> I mean, he would have made the 710. I would argue that was closer than it would have been had I tried to slice it. Yeah, but I just think your chance of making it is so much lower. I've made that spare like three times on tour this year. You're a professional. I'm barely an amateur. Are you making a move? Because you're clearly smoking me here. I have, well, I'm just going to keep my 10 board move. Oh, okay. So you can get dialed in. That? I'm joining helpful. you. I feel like I thought they were going to hook so much less from it. My original target was third arrow, but I probably hit like 16 or 17. So now I'm looking at fifth arrow. Not for the spare though. I didn't try and bounce it because I'm not an idiot. I know my percentages, and my percentages of bouncing that, way worse than Brent's. I cannot strike from in there. That's so far in. I'm in the nosebleed section. I thought it wouldn't hook, though. Do you think it's hooking early when I'm in that, dude? I think you're trying to make it hook more. Oh, absolutely. You think I, should, I could just throw a normal shot from in there? Yeah, I don't think you need to rotate it that You put this over your head, it's like a helicopter. <laughs> Luke, I am your father. I'm about due for that 10 board move. I'm not gonna let you get up on me. It's gonna be a smoke show. I only have so many opportunities at the keys. I'm gonna go back, yeah, I'm gonna go back to normal. It was a really nice bowling shot. I'm not gonna lie, I was a little out of focus on that one, watching you walk up next to me while- Oh, there was a piece of lint near the foul line I had sure, to grab. Yeah, sure there was. Now that's bad form. Man, oh man, That's I what can't you believe me. you did that. <laughs> I thought you were better than that. Wow. It slipped out of my hand, I was changing no tape. No Steve Nagy award for this guy. I was changing tape, slipped out of my hands. They are starting to hook. I'm looking forward to going to lane one. I'm looking forward to going to lane one too. Oh no. Oh, I didn't get it left. And, and we're back. You'll be in trouble if I figure this puppy out. That's your angle. This? Yeah, that's, no. you love it there. Whoa, whoa! Love whoa. it. So much in there. I love it. We'll make it. Yeah. See, this is how we keep everything under control here. Is that the play? Keep it nice and dry back there. I'm only up seven. 
Yeah, because you're giving it to me. I don't know if I'm giving it to you. Pity, pity shots. Oh, baby. They are starting to hook, though. I, I'm watching your ball do all sorts of the I wrong thing. I think it's thing the fan. Mind. I think the fan's drying, dissipating the oil. Drying the lanes out? Yes. Gotta have it. It is a lot of fun. Most days it still feels like a dream. There are little slivers of nightmares, but most days still a dream come true. Nice spare. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Ah! Yeah, they are. They're just hooking in a spot and I don't know what to do about it. Oh, I got it right. At the bottom. Shoot it. Strike it Not to great. 204, which would mean... So maybe I should get seven or less, is what you're saying? No, There I'm might be some strategery here. No, I'm technically, I still... You uh, could win yeah. by 20 if I have seven or less here. And I could? No, Zero. No, I don't think I should. Zero. Oh, doggone it. So you got to go another 10 to the right, is what you say? I got to go back to that same spot that I love so much. 10 or 10 to the left. I could go and play oh, eight. You Oh, I could. That might be easier. That was a clutch wash. I'm not sure that was on purpose. Jim Jam. A very nice bowling shot. Kids, pay attention, kids. God, God, I really gave up some opportunity this game. You brought the fan out and it dried the lanes out right away. Yes. Luke! Come on! So there's the 21 pinner. And I say you're lucky. All right, so you're bowling first on the left lane. He's on there, nice and patchy for me. That way I'm not up 20 at the end of the game, so I can start off throwing it where I want to. Sounds like reindeer, doesn't it? Oh my lanta. It's music to my ears. silly. Hooky, hooky. Looky, looky, I got hooky. All right, I gotta move again. I have a max score of 518 to Brent's 490. Moving right. All it takes is for me to get lined up from like 35 at the arrows, and then I'm golden. Were you telling the audience you were about to put the nail in my coffin? And then lock the door with the keys that you give me. All right, let's get focused. focused. Telling them what the max scores were. 518 to 490, I'm up 28. So it's time for a move, that's what you're saying. Yeah, I already moved last shot. I already moved oh, last okay. shot. Oh, okay. <laughs> 22 little, sticks right there, my friend. A little too deep. That is 22. Only up six now. It's only a six pin game here. Worst case scenario is I go down late. You haven't even had to move yet. I know, it's part of my strategy. I can go back, thank God. That's <laughs> making my legs cold. I don't like you, I don't like you in that part of the lane. I love me in that part of the lane. That's the good part of the lane right there. That's the one that strikes. I think for you, if I held this like head high on full power. I like it. He likes that, he definitely does like that. <laughs> little fast, little left. I got a really good matchup with that ball right now. I'm not gonna lie. I just hope we don't take a 20 minute break here for Brent to come back. Whoa, 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 whoa. Did you leave me that rack on purpose? Must be the racks in this building. They could be better, I'll admit that. Our goal is to do the best we can. These are A's, Brunswick A's, not A2's, so they are a little different. God, What's the difference between, What's the difference between an A and an A2? A2's a newer machine. He's setting me up for failure here. I can feel it. I was only up six, but now I'm up I can't believe I missed that backup 3610. That's the gimme that I shouldn't miss. That might be the nail in the coffin. Play one tighter. All right, let me go talk to this big rig again. I can't.
Big loft, big loft. Oh, come on. Oh, my mercy. I feel like Shaq. Nice job, nice job. I think it's time for you to move again. I just did. What, do you think that's where I'm normally playing? Listen, if you miss again here, I'll go the other way. I'll go 20 left. <sighs> Been all pocket shots so far this game, I think. Ha ha, ha ha ha. Man, you look like you like it right there. Yeah! Oh no. I told you if you I told you if you missed again, I'd go the other direction. I'm in trouble. All that work to get my first bowling alley. You only get the keys to Seneca though, right? Yeah. I get to keep the keys to Derby. You get to keep the Derby keys. I don't even need the master key. Just give me like a little side door key where I could turn a lane on at 5 a.m. I said I'd go the other way if he missed again. He's got a max of 448. I got a max of 496. Yeah, I'm going 10 left of the original placement. Well, that was pretty good. I wanted it. I wanted it bad. Still a long reach for me. People have already turned off the channel. They're already bored. Game's over. They're leaving their seats. Reel them back in here. Are you telling me the left side's easier than the right side? I'm not saying it's harder. There are times where the left side's harder than the right. PBA Tour 2024. Oh boy, way right. Hot dog. Oh my dog. God, they're just too easy there. Hot dog. What is that? What is that? If you put that in your mouth, I would throw up immediately. Hey, that might be a good defensive strategy. Get a little bowling alley. Wait, do you lint. want me to go left Everybody or right? Everybody has a little bowling alley lint. Do you want me to go left or right? What do you think? I think you need to move forward about four feet. No, I prefer you stay left so you don't can't so you can't generate the ball speed. Maybe that was the move I needed to make forward by four feet. I'm a spare shooter though. The forward by four feet, by the way. What a, what a move that was. Good strategy. Oh, I missed the head pin, yeah. I just left it by itself out of it. Well, one, three. I'm up 18. I'm down 18, I can get to 49. I need you to Greek church. I have to open. Should I be nervous? Or should I, oh, I get to do what I want again, at least. Jesus Christ. Oh, darn <laughs> it. I think I helped you. I needed a little bit extra push down there. You know sometimes when you, you get that moment when you throw a shot off your hand and you just ask your ball to push? That's it right there. I don't know what you're doing. Yeah. I got a bowl league here. That was sweaty. I was dry until you hugged me. <laughs> now I'm moist. Thank you for sticking around all the way to the end. If you guys like this video, you wanna see more of Brent, send a challenge down below that you'd like to see us either compete in or work together to try and complete. Thank you guys for watching and thank you Brent for letting me take your keys. Thanks. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace.